A popular Whitefish Middle School teacher has a life-threatening kidney disease, but he's using teaching as a way to cope with the uncertainty. Kid Pax's Martin Shoes, Sue shows us how this educator is using a positive approach. A beloved Whitefish Middle School teacher now fights for his life after an unexpected kidney diagnosis. I was working out to get in shape and lost a lot of weight and then quit working out and then actually ended up losing more weight without really doing a lot. We're kind of like, well, that's weird, but you kind of, you know, especially being a guy, you kind of attribute it to it's like, oh, it's nothing, any big deal. What started off as a normal doctor's appointment for Sean Duff soon turned frightening. With unusual blood levels, Duff's doctor informed him he needed to get to the emergency room immediately. They put, immediately had me get in a gown, put three IVs in one arm, two in the other, and are like, you have severe kidney failure, we don't know why, but that's not the problem right now. You're in actually critical condition because of the levels in your blood. Doctors soon discovered Duff had polycystic kidney disease, a hereditary disease he was completely unaware of as neither one of his parents exhibit the disease. While normal kidneys filter out toxins in our body, Duff explains how his kidneys differ. Those extra, um, I guess nutrients don't get trapped in my kidney because it has cysts all over it, they develop holes. And so when the blood goes through it, it doesn't trap any of the toxins, which we urinate out. So it goes right back into my blood. And Duff soon found out this disease was serious. My calcium level dropped, which caused me to have a seizure, and I coded. And for about 45 seconds. To prevent this from happening again, Duff desperately needs a kidney transplant. But in the meantime, he goes to dialysis three times a week, which mimics what healthy kidneys would do. As an escape, Duff turns to his students. It, it didn't let my mind think about all the what ifs and the scariness of things, which was really good. So. It was great to be able to have school. Duff has a positive outlook on his disease and continues not to let it stop him from doing the things he loves, like hiking, fishing, and hunting. As a Whitefish native, Duff wants to thank everybody in the Whitefish community for showing their support during his difficult diagnosis. In Whitefish, Marin Sue, MTN News. Now, many have been tested to see if they can be a viable kidney donor, but Duff is still on the transplant list awaiting a new kidney somewhere.